Hi everybody and welcome back to Erin's Tea. As promised, I wanted to do a review of the Palm Court in the Drake Hotel's afternoon tea. Now if you're not familiar of what afternoon tea really consists of, um, it started about uh, in 1840 uh, and it was the seventh Duchess of Bedford who between three and four would get hungry. So you know, it's in between lunch and supper, and so she began a daily habit of having tea and bread and butter brought up to her room. And so she did it so often, it became a tradition. So this is a mainly British tradition that is in many tea rooms across the world. And the Drake Hotel has a fabulous place called the Palm Court. And it's a very classic designed room. It's got a fountain, statues. It's just all very elegant. And so they offer a high tea, and um, you can go throughout the week. Um, usually they offer it between 1 and 5 p.m. Each sitting usually lasts about an hour and a half. And so my husband and I made a reservation for 2 p.m. And when you get in, you're greeted. It's very beautiful. They seat you in these beautiful chairs, and you've already got all your teaware laid out. So the only decision you actually have to make is what tea you're going to try. And they have a, a list of about probably about 15 different teas to try. So of course I picked Earl Grey and my husband of course picked Bombay Chai. So they bring out a nice tower of pastries and sandwiches and they had these amazing scones um, and it's served with preserves, lemon curd, and this Devon cream. It was so, so, so amazing. I don't even want to know how many calories was in the cream, but the cream was to die for. Uh, the tea was not bad. My husband says his was really good, but I found my tea didn't have enough flavor for me. Maybe I didn't steep it long enough. So other than that, the servers were really professional. Uh, they saw that we had cameras, so they offered to take pictures for us. And then the events manager, Sean, who was fabulous, came over and introduced himself to us. And he saw that um, I had my phone out and he said, well, he offered us champagne, which is awesome. I never turned down champagne. And he said, if we checked in on Foursquare, that the second glass of champagne is a penny. So it was a win-win situation. So my husband and I had champagne and tea and it was fantastic so I definitely recommend going to the Palm Court in the Drake Hotel if you are in Chicago it is an experience in itself um, the events manager said that Vince Vaughn actually pops in quite often so if you're a big fan of his you might just happen to see him there so um, if you have any other tea rooms that you've had experiences with Please feel free to share with me on the Facebook page, send me an email, um, and if you have any other suggestions of, of where to go, please let me know. So until next time, that's tea to me.